Hi guys, and how are you doing? Andy here on Andy's Weird World. Right, we're going to do um, another visit. We're going to visit a, a village in Cambridgeshire. I hope you like it. Uh, don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you haven't, because that would be actually fantastic. Uh, also, share the videos, leave a comment, and uh, well, anyway, let's uh, let's roll the logo. Hi guys and welcome to Andy's Weird World and um, we're in a rural village in Cambridgeshire and uh, it's actually called Ashwell and it's a, it's, a, you know, it's, a, it's a typical typical little village actually like some of, like some of the pubs like the one behind me uh, it's a house now uh, it used to be called the Cricketers but it's now a house and of course across from the road from the Cricketers or the old pub that used to be called the Cricketers is the um, Plain grounds. Anyway, what I do, I thought we're gonna have, we're gonna have a little walk around Ashwell and see see what we can see because um, it's famous for its spring. It's got a spring here, so I think we're gonna have a little walk down to that. Well, I've just come off um, uh, the high street and we're now at uh, Springhead. So that means we must be actually quite near the spring here in Ashwell. So um, actually, I do know where it is. Um, it is, it's, it's down there, so let's go and have a look. Right, there we go. Right, see Ashwell Springs. You see the water actually coming up as well. Right, so we're going to head back to the to the high street. To see what it is. Well, I like quite a few of the. Uh, villages around here of course there's lots of pubs and um, here's one here uh, this one is called the uh, uh, the three tons it seems to be a, a quite popular pub here in Ashwell well we're walking down the high street still here in uh, Ashwell, as you see behind me, lots of uh, lots of old houses and everything, and uh, lots of uh, lots of uh, little shops as well. Right, 
Right, as normally actually, we, we look around and we see different types of property and how much they are. So in Ashwell, let's have a look. Um, we have uh, this one here, which is a uh, half a million, one and a half million. Uh, another one here for 950,000. And then we go down, down market a bit, 600,000. So property actually in Ashwell is, uh, Quite expensive, but it's a nice village. About five years ago, Jerry Clarkson and company, Top Gear, did some filming here in um, Ashwell, and uh, I think it, I think they were driving some massive combines actually um, through the high street here, and they they actually only just made it because it was a it was a bit of a um, Bit of a squeeze. Oh, here's uh, the local um, baker there. That's Days, a local baker. Uh, we've gone a little bit further. Um, yes, we come across uh, to another another pub, the Rose and Crown. Right. Well, so from the local pub. Um, <laughs> Well, this is where an old telephone box is actually coming uh, coming useful. Yeah, I, I've just come across a shop I haven't even noticed before. Actually, it's called the Kirby Man and Music Shop, and uh, it's in there. And uh, well, they've got, as you can see, lots of uh, oldie worldy musical instruments well it actually looks like we've come across another ex pub this one here behind me the bear house anyway we we'll keep on walking down the high street see what else we can see what other little gems Ashwell brings up Right, we, we've actually come across a Ashwell Gallery. Actually, never been in there, but uh, that's there. I mean, being a Sunday, it's, it's closed anyway. So we have uh, quite a few other businesses here. Dixies. Let's have a quick look. Okay. So this must be the Ashwell Gallery here. It's, uh, paintings that they have. And this must be Dixie Court. Right. We're in one of the back streets here in um, Nashville. That's a nice row of cottages over there. It looks like uh, we've got the church, the church behind us. So we're going to look so we can see. Oh, there's a museum here in Ashwell as well. I didn't know that. That's just over here. Well, it looks like they've got their own butchers here in Ashwell. Crumps. And I've just crossed from the church. Of course, there has to be a pub. Here we are. This is the, uh, the bushel and strike. The biggest church here in Ashwell, and uh, this is St Mary's, all in its splendour.
Well, it looks like that used to be a pub as well. Maybe the uh, the Five Bells. I think the that thing on the wall there gives that away there. Right. We'll continue walking in the back streets of Ashwell. Like all villages, there's a memorial for the people who fell in the Great Wars. You know, most villages, they, they, they have a church and they may be lucky, they have a pub still. And if they're even, even luckier, they may even have a shop. But Ashford's very lucky because guess what? They have got their own garage, which is, there we go, their own garage. And um, it sells fuel and um, you know, of course you get your car repaired here as well. So I think Ashford are very, very lucky. Well, here's something I don't really understand actually. We're about five miles away from Ashwell and uh, well, we have Ashwell railway station. So let's, let's, let's have a quick look at that. This is it, the Ashwell and Morden Railway Station. Um, and this one actually goes to King's Cross. It goes from Cambridge to King's Cross. And it's around about probably 45 minutes away from London. You know, what I didn't know about um, Ashwell, there was actually a, sort of a, a scram yard. I've just come across that by accident. So let's have a look at that. Well, there we go. That's my little walk, light-hearted view of Ashwell, a little village in Cambridgeshire. And I uh, hope you liked it. Hey, don't forget to subscribe, like, and also share my videos because that would be fantastic. Once again, I'd like to say thanks very much for watching. And um, hey, we'll catch you later. Bye for now. Bye.